I'm on a fucking hot streak right now. Oh, nobody. I don't know why I'm rubbing my nipples. Oh, nobody can stop me right now. Ooh. <laughs>
gonna no scope him in the face. No. <laughs> oh, do you know what? I don't even care. <laughs> Around the back. Bro. There's some AR yep. for you. Ooh. Ooh. That was a no scope, dude, to the face. Why did I do this? I hate everything about today. No corpses. Excuse me, sir. Could you provide me some corpses? I would really like to get my skeletons back. Yeah, the strong... Oh, this guy fucked me. This guy was so hard when I did this as um, a sock. So hard. Like, I keep getting fucked in lane. Wow, that is... Here's me, fucking Betty Big Balls talking, and I've got 13k damage. I have the least damage in the fucking game. <laughs> the Yumi, their support has more damage than I do. I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna like flop it around a bit, you know, stretch the, <laughs> stretch the cartilage. I don't know if I've got the energy to even be able to massage my own wrists. You can't even put me on the fucking door properly. This is like the Titanic all over again. There's clearly enough fucking room on that door. Why am I halfway down? Let's go, Wolf Squad. Oh, oh! <laughs> mm. oh wait, I wasn't on the Wolf Squad. That's why. Oh! We're the bears. <laughs> what do we do? <laughs> that was an amazing uh, bear we, impression. Yep. We have Honk! Honk! I'm an eagle. It's not an Honk. eagle. Honk! <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, no. You think you're going somewhere? You think you're going somewhere, dog? <laughs> I accidentally grappled Nelly and I was scared. Oh, no. In the air! I'm watching. Yeah, this is just notes. embarrassing. Oh, you should. Just TP, TP, trust. <laughs> I'm gonna bait them this way. Watch this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no way there'll be someone camping the TP. Absolutely. <laughs> 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 Oh, he's making me jump. Okay, fuck it. I'm going ulti just in case. Oh, what no, I can't run. How? <laughs> Ow. Lots of memes. Oh, my God. Oh, that's how you rotate the sage wall. <laughs> oh, no shit. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. Guys, I got it. Good job. I don't use... This is like the first game of sage ever, by the way. Have fun, Sarah. Oh, oh. <laughs> Fuck, I forgot I you were just had a fucking heart attack. <laughs> Can you just go in and die? Because I need to I need to use this res. Well, I'm I was gonna like die that rounds. round, but then I didn't. But then I did, and then you didn't rest me. Hey look, she doesn't she doesn't figure it out yet that I'm actually just gonna do it right in the open. And just let her die twice. <laughs> What? I told you I told you exactly what I was gonna do and I did exactly what I was gonna do. Can you wall wall me up? Oh you already know this is not gonna go hang out something it's <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, that's exactly what I wanted. <laughs> Actual perfect slow. No. Actual perfect wall. Oh, oh my, my god. god. <laughs> <laughs> I'm slow. <laughs> I actually couldn't have had a worse wall <laughs> if you tried. Wall. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Sorry for stealing that off you. Oh, I didn't sell off you, you got it. I don't know if you've noticed but I'm a person with big lips, okay? Some would say, perfect for dick sucking, right? But with big lips comes big problems, okay?
explain this. This is a show. Oh, nice. get out of here! Nice, good job. <laughs> See, finding with the power. Are you fucking kidding me? I love you, warts and all. As if warts are the worst thing that a person can have. Let me tell you, there's a lot worse issues than warts. It should be. The new saying should be. Um, we love you, Trump supporter and all. Flashing. I got all of us. Perfect. Perfect. Got, got all of us. Just in case, right? Just in case they were there. One heaven. Flashing. Very good. Very nice. Go, go, go. The yellow. None of us know what the fuck we're doing. And if you if you say you do, you're lying. None of us know what we're doing. We're all just fucking making it up as we go along. Just tie your balls in a knot to last longer. Is that a thing? Do people do that? Do, people, do, do guys tie their balls in a knot to last longer? Is that a thing? I just go with the old classic. Think of something really unsexy. Usually for me, it's like a slab of salmon. <laughs> like fish and chips like the worst the most unsexy thing i could imagine our parents generation could buy a house for a fucking cheese sandwich legitimately for a leicester cheese sandwich they could have bought a house it's ridiculous your sexuality doesn't fucking matter if you wanted to be gay be gay if you want to be fucking married to a car marry a car and if they have a problem with it, that is 100% their issue. You should never apologize for who you are or who you want to be to someone else, family or not. I don't give a shit. Not having kids is now the normal. By the way, just in case anyone needs a reminder, not having children is the norm. And do you know why? Because how the fuck are we supposed to afford it? I can't afford to look after myself. I am in incredible amounts of debt. And I'm still having to get help from family to keep going. People have kids for all the wrong fucking reasons these days. 100%. Think one of the, one of the amazing things about being an adult is you get to choose your family. Family doesn't necessarily have to be blood. You get to choose who you surround yourself with. You get to choose who who has the influence on you right and i'm not saying disown your family by any means i'm just saying you don't if they're you know if, if they're consistently making you feel like that choose a new family surround yourself with people who make you feel good about yourself because ultimately that's all we're here for that's all we're trying to do here right just trying to feel good about ourselves and, and, and live the happiest life we can right uh, I also think about parents' generation. I feel like a lot of us were self-satisfaction or obligation kids. Oh, I, I like could not agree more, honey. Actually, actually, could not agree more. I I 100% think, and that's that's what I'm saying. People have kids for for completely the wrong reasons, right? They were having kids to to make themselves feel important, and like, and like you know li their legacy living on and all of this bullshit. Things change. Life changes. So we, we're able to move with that, right? We're able to be dynamic and change with the time. And the truth is the way that the world works now is kids just aren't sustainable for a lot of people. Unless you have a dual income, kids aren't, aren't sustainable. So you just got to be flexible. And, and the problem with the older generation is they're really not. They have no flexibility in, in what they consider. And the thing is, they're so set that what they're saying is right. Do you know what I mean? They're like, no, you have to do it our way. You have to get a job, which is your career for the rest of your life and have kids and have a, have a house by your 30s and all of this shit. No, that's you living life by your standard. You're inflicting your standard onto me. That's all that you're doing there. I know that outside of streaming, I genuinely have no prospects. I really, really don't. As an entertainer, I think I'm great. 
Otherwise, I have zero prospects. And I don't really have any other qualifications. I've got no other options, I'll be honest. But to make a good life for myself, I have no other options. In the career that I spent 15 years making, I can no longer do. I got nada. Just happened to have picked the one, one of the things which is probably the most in-demand jobs in the world right now that everybody wants to do. Honestly, Lex, though, that's a really common thing because, and that's one of the one of the things I love about gaming and why I love gaming so much and why I really love that you know this this community that we built is because it's you know because we spend so much time online. It is inevitable that so many of our friends are here, right? Um, yeah, so when, when, when I was having a catheter in and it was going wrong, the first thing I did was say to my mum and my sister, okay. you need to come take a look at my penis right now because something is not right. They're not seeing it as my mum and my sister. They're seeing it as, nurse, as nurses. You're going to make a really out of context blurb, aren't you? You fucking dicks. Just making sure I add this to my uh, to my jamming in the shower playlist. We all have them. Don't fucking lie. If you don't sing in the shower, are you even living life? <laughs> no, 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 dog. Not wanking in the shower. That's a very different playlist. And often involves video. Got, I've got something to keep you going. All right. Okay. <laughs> Welcome back to the Simply Nickish League. He is currently on the tail end of a 24 hour stream and he is almost there, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, he's currently down by the field. We have uh, someone down there ready to ask, ask some questions. Simply Nickish, how are you feeling today with only one hour left on the clock? It's been a long run. You know, it's been a really hard slog. I think, you know, me and the guys have uh, really worked well together. You know, we've really pulled each other through. Um, just gonna do this last home stretch and uh and then we can all sit down at the end and i'm gonna go straight to sleep and be proud you heard it here first folks he's going to go straight the fuck to sleep <laughs> ladies and gentlemen stay tuned for the final hour of simply nickish's 24 hour stream be the version of you that makes you the happiest that's all that matters what a way to end there you go. There's your there's your Nick's motivational Sunday talk.